hi guys welcome back to today's video so today is saturday and the weather is extremely nice it's time for saturday weekend shopping so guys this weekend my friend is coming home with her husband she was coming to our house to visit me for the very first time my friend is a brazilian and the husband is a dutch a german man and guys you know how it is these people these both of them the two both of them they don't like to eat pepper i say hey what will i cook for these people i said okay and we are going to make little food for them so Pre the previous day, which was on Friday, my husband went and bought plantain. Plantain is practically the food that you can serve in any German, in any German party, and they will eat and eat and eat and not stop eating. So after we picked plantain, I decided that we we're going to make salad, very simple salad. I have some cherry tomatoes at home in the fridge, and I decided I was going to take a salad. The thing is that you see this salad you're seeing here. If you buy the wrong one, my sister, you will not be able to eat. It will be like bitter leaf. So, I said no. I shall pick the other salad. They used to call it iceberg salad. I picked some uh, some tomatoes and I also saw some fruits. So, I picked. These, are, these ones is not for them. These fruits are not for them. So, I decided that I was going to cook chicken. I'm going to roast chicken for them. Guys, you see this chicken? German people like this chicken like shege. We don't like to eat this chicken. We eat it like two or three times in a year or four times. Like we don't like this 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 soft chicken. We don't like it. So I said, okay, I'll pick something for steak, but I'm going to make it Nigerian way, but without pepper. Without pepper. This people don't use to eat pepper. But the thing is that I am going to also make jollof rice. So I decided that I was going to make jollof rice fry plantain i'm going to make um i'm going to make um grilled meat and put it inside the oven to really really cook so i'm not going to make their normal steak you know the steak that they they eat is there's always a kind of is raw is half done and stuff like that. So no so i sauce it properly without pepper and that is what i'm going to serve in it so guys we are actually in leader and, um, you know, every week there's always a new sales that they bring new things. I would decided to check out some things. My husband is actually looking for LED, LED. And, uh, he saw it here last week. So he just came out to check if they still have it or not. So if you need cheap things, you need different things. Anytime I come to Lidl or Aldi every week, especially weekends that I have time, I just go to this aisle, this side, where you get all of the good things that they brought within the week. So, guys, things are really expensive in Germany. You cannot believe it. Okay, guys, apart from the things that I bought, I said, okay, let us just see other places. Maybe sometimes you'll just be walking and you just remember, hey, I don't have toothpaste to... I don't have shaving stick or I don't have this. It's when you see those things in the supermarket that you will not remember you don't have it. For example, just look at it. I'll just be looking and say, hey, I will buy dustbin nylon. I will go to the shop and come back. I will not buy dustbin nylon. I will not, if I don't see the dustbin nylon, I will not remember that I needed dustbin nylon. Look at it now. Look at it, shaving stick. Since I've been carrying hair in our I've been going up and down. It was when I saw shaving stick that I would remember that we needed to buy seven stick, so we bought seven stick. Okay, guys, Aldi is very, very nice. When it comes to vegetables and fruits, I like to buy from Aldi because it holds longer in the fridge. I'm not saying that I don't buy from, from Lidl, but hey, I don't like it. It doesn't say, I don't know the difference. I don't know what the problem is, but anyway, I don't like to buy things from them. So we decided that this is what we are going to cook for our friend. And today I'm not going to be making video because I just wanted us to like, I don't want to show their face. I don't want to show anything about them. I just wanted us to have fun and support her. Like I told you guys that she's really, really sick. And hey guys, look, I was just standing on where we are going to pay when I just saw this ingwa and cucumber uh, shot. This is, um, sorry, this is ingwa. Ingwa is ginger, ginger and turmeric shot. And it is bio. So, I don't know. I've never used it before. But when I sighted it, you know me now, I rushed to grab one. I said, let me just test it and see you. Normally, I would do my shot at home. But let me just test. Because they say it's bio. Ah, I don't know. Let me just test it. So, we have finished shopping. This is me. Yes. This is me. I need to show you people my clothes. It is 30, 35, 40 degree in Germany. And we have said that we are in pant and bra. We are officially allowed 
to go naked if you like because this son can impregnate you. This son can make you run mad. I'm telling nobody is behaving normal again in Germany. Everybody don't worry. Everybody, everybody wear pants and bra. Nobody they even they look if you're born, but they shake. I'll be not they shake. Mm. Nobody, nobody get your time. Son, they hit. He shake and come off our body, but I love the weather. Ah, ah. Every time, jacket, 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 jacket. It is time to remove all those clothes that you have since three years that you have no worn. Eh, it is time to rock it. Thank God for the weather. So, guys, this is practically us going back into the car. And we bought everything we needed. And I am loving the weather. And I can't wait them to come. So, to come and try Nigerian jollof rice. <laughs> you know that I will represent everywhere that I go. So, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. See you next in my video. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. Thank you. Bye.